All right, so here we'll show you a quick video of smoothing out a very, very rough uh, concave shape uh, on a dome. So you'll see here, uh, in order to adjust your trowel for a concave shape, you gotta over bend it. Uh, so just very slightly, uh, but that will allow it to not dig in the corners when you're using it on an angle. So as long as you're applying your material at the proper angle, uh, based on the shape of your trowel, your preset shape, then there's really no issue. It just works like any conventional trowel would on a flat surface. Uh, but the idea of our trial is that you can really preset that shape that you want the material to, to stay at. So as you can see here, uh, the material is not, you know, the trial is not digging into those deeper corners or creating flat spots on those flat uh, surfaces. It's really just leaving the exactly proper amount of material uh, to follow the shape that we've set our blade at. Uh, so it doesn't matter whether it's drywall mud or stucco or concrete or plaster. Uh, if you typically apply the material using a flat trowel and it works well, then it'll work just as fine using our uh, radius trowel for a curved surface. Uh, so time is money. Any way to make our life easier, uh, that's what it's all about. Uh, we have three different sizes, so 12 inch, 14 inch and 16 inch. Each blade comes with a, uh, in the option of uh, round corners, square corners or semicircles. Uh, so typically I would recommend the semicircle more for the concrete industry, uh, but it's really up to you to decide uh, which uh, shape works best for your needs. Uh, so as you can see, uh, any concave or convex shape, this trial will uh, adjust to any range. We'll show the smoothing of a convex dome in another video, so make sure to check that one out as well. As you'll see here, we got fantastic results and only two coats, uh, so thanks to the radius trial.